Oh, and there, there what was the other thing that she so, did? So, oh. The, well, she claimed someone assaulted her. What, right, right. Grilled right. cheese? What's the They Asian went guy? to a party. Grilled part. cheese? <laughs> rice gum? gum? Rice gum. Yeah, 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 yeah. My yeah, dad yeah. called rice yeah. gum <laughs> grilled cheese. It was some kind of food. That's the yeah. best ever. He had just come back from somewhere. He was tired. <laughs> And he was jet lagged. Wait, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay. On. I'm still recovering from grilled Girl cheese. cheese. <laughs> oh, that's so Two good. words and a food in there. So. Oh. Yeah, it was food. Rice gum's got to be known as grilled cheese now. Do you like grilled cheese? Uh, it, the nah, guy. Nah, 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 nah. Okay, so wait, wait, wait. So you're saying Trisha's downplaying the friendship, but do you think Gabby's up playing the friendship with Trisha? Yes. There's some, you know, there's the truth and then there's the truth. They're both playing at it. Yeah. 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 They both are, are Why drama. Why can't they just queens? drop it? Why is it always got to be like, well, who cares how close they were? You know what I mean? Because everyone's got to win. But it's just so stupid. Like, who cares how close you were? Gab is like, we're best friends. It's just like, we, I didn't know you at all. It's like, who gives a fuck? Well, that's the whole thing of their drama. Hmm. You know, that's the. the. Can I hit your Coke Zero? Can you what? Can I hit your Coke Zero? Hit it? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Thank you. Is that one of the words? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, oh. So that was a bra moment right there. A bra. That was not a bra moment. Was that a bra? You interrupted moment? her to want to hit the coke. That's a bra moment. Oh, well, she, she was. Oh, that's a bra you. moment, but that's not a bra moment. A bra moment. Bra. Don't even try. Okay. If the moment is lost. Oh, your lipstick's all over it? Mm. I gotta like pour it in a cup. Well, you can wipe it off. I don't have cooties. Is that. Here, hold on one sec. So she went. she went to. This party with all of these vlog uh, people, you know, the squad or whatever. <laughs> and this guy, this rice Let's call him grilled guy. cheese. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this grilled cheese was tired and jet lagged. And she said, can I, you know, have a, you know, can I record you? And he, oh, that was the soda pop. And he said, no, please don't put this, let's not record this. And she kept on going on and on and pushing him and pushing him. And it's like, he's tired, he's hungry, leave the guy alone. Mm. But she just kept on digging and digging. And finally, he lost it, got mad, and whacked the phone out of her hand. Mm. The phone got broken but she took it a step farther and said that he hit her mm. which he did not oh so we are defending yeah she's here today yeah and and, Rice gum. and they even showed pictures of her knees when she when it was being recorded that she had bruises on her knees before the you know she, she had actually hit the phone out of her she was trying to claim that he gave her the bruises on her yeah yeah, she but was like you, she. He assaulted her. Yeah, she, but you can see in the video those bruises were already there. Right. Uh, Correct. You guys did some deep dive. This yeah. is good stuff. And and the yeah. the guy who he was sitting here talking to also responded to this and gave a very apparently truthful version of what happened. Where right. he just grabbed the phone out of her hand and smashed it. But I think she was trying to set him up initially because. I guess he is well known for rapping spontaneously and she had accused him of, of, you know, like memorizing the raps and not doing it. So she was trying to embarrass him by sticking the camera in his face. And it's right. like, you know, I don't want to do that. Past the breaking point. You know, and people would have done well, the do same. You, do you believe that grilled cheese was justified in breaking the phone? No, no, there's no justification for yeah, him. He didn't think that either. Phone, and he then mowed her like $2,000. Oh, right he after. did? Yeah, yeah. He paid, he paid for, the, for phone the phone well more than it was worth. Okay. Do you know, Gabby. Are we giving a shout out to Rice Gum here now? Grilled cheese, I'm on your side. Were we giving a shout out to him? Yes. Friend of the pod, I believe. No. no. He's no. an enemy of the pod. He's an enemy okay, of the never pod. Never mind. But well, no, you I think don't it, are we giving him a shout out I here? I don't believe, I don't like the guy, okay. honestly. Not a shout out. But it was not. It, what don't you like about him? I don't know. He's just weird. Right. He's just uh, really weird. Dad, you have a take you on it? You can't even understand I, him. He's I just didn't weird. I watch any of his videos, so I didn't really form an opinion on I him couldn't other understand than a heck being the victim of false accusations. So yeah. your team rice gum. Give him a shout out, Dad. Don't be afraid. Well, uh, 
as opposed to Team Gabby, undoubtedly, yes. Yes. On God. On God. Yes. On, on God. God. Correct. On, on guard. guard. <laughs> <laughs> and Gabby, when she first started, she, I mean, she has a heck of a lot of nerve because she used to steal jokes oh. from other other. Wow. Uh, a lot of nerve. Yep. You know, something I read today I didn't know, apparently, this one kid put together a comp, just like some random dude put together a compilation of all the jokes she stole, and she was, like, trying to threaten him. Oh, she doxed him? Did you hear? Oh, that? yeah. Oh, she does that all the time. She'll, <laughs> she'll, you know. Wait, so what did she? She claims videos, and she, mm. she unfriends you, and mm. she's mean. Well, and she had the same lame excuse for every joke she stole, which was, well, this was a couple years ago, and I might have heard it, and it went into my subconscious, and then right. when I said it right. later, well, I didn't remember right. where it came from. Right, but the mm. thing is, on some of Do her- Do you buy that, Dad? No. Hell no. <laughs> no, because on some of her her uh, vlogs or videos, she says, oh, yeah, I'm really familiar. I follow these guys. I think they're great. But then- Magically, if, their jokes appear in her- Exactly. Oh, we don't like that. Right. I know Bo Burnham- <laughs> Friend of the pod. Yes, uh, Bo is a friend of the had, pod. She had a joke stolen, among oh. others. Oh, yeah, she had a weird... Did you guys see how she was pretending that she was dating Bo for a while? No. Oh, you guys didn't see that? No. Yeah. We well, only no. had so much time. <laughs> Apparently, there's, yeah, there's more to her than... Big dossier. Yeah. I will say one thing about uh, Gabby and Trisha mm -hmm. that I kind of respect... And that is sometimes you see them on the video and they're all dolled up and they look very pretty. Yeah. And then sometimes you see them without any makeup at all and they look like shit. <laughs> but they're comfortable in their own skin. Right. To do that. Yeah, I respect that about Trisha. So that's something I respect. There you go. Them. That's nice to say something nice. Can you say something else nice about Gabby Hanna before we move on? Uh, let me think. <laughs> uh, God, that's a hard one. <laughs> well, I think someone called her the worst person in that they had met, met in L.A., and I just wanted to point out she's not from here. Oh. She's from somewhere else, and a friend gave her a ride out here, and then she dissed him. And said he was a bad person for no apparent reason after he drove her all the way out here. So she can go back to the East Coast, wherever she came from. <laughs> We're kicking her Clean up. up L.A. a little we bit. We don't yes. want Gabby in L.A. Go back to where you came go from. Go back kind to of. where you came from. Right? Well, I can Second generation native Californian. So we are xenophobic against Gabby Hanna. No, back to where you fair. came from. Yeah. yeah. There's one. <laughs> there's one thing I can say on her in her defense. Yeah. Just one little tiny thing. Okay. And that is, although, you know, I I wasn't there, so I don't know, but she says that she has food issues. She said she's had an eating disorder, yes. Well, I know she has an eating disorder, but I think, is it food issues? Like she's got allergies? Oh, I, what is she? I don't know. I think that's what she said, that she had allergies. And, and like when she did some movies or videos with these guys, they didn't provide proper food. And it was a long day. And as a person who has you know, celiac disease and all kinds of food issues, mm -hmm. I have a lot of allergies and I have to be extremely careful. That's why I'm so bloody skinny is because of food issues. And if you don't provide your guests with proper food, that's not, you know, that's not fair. So we're defending Gabby that we're talking about the, the, yeah, she made a, a bunch of movies. A movie. Yeah. Like YouTube, the YouTube his. thing with Joey. Yeah, Gap, uh, right. They and, killed off her character at the end, but she stayed for hours. She, she had a valid point there with the food. But when it came to other things with the script, and this isn't right. And the costumes. It reminded me of Trisha telling you she wanted to say in employees. No, no, you don't get a say. You're you're working for them. Right, her costumes. You came to do a job. If you don't like it, leave. You know, it's, mm. it's not up to you to make those kinds of decisions. Mm. And is there something you want to say, Mom? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I mean... There's a lot of movie stars. Dad and I were just watching uh, the making of some of these these uh, 
um, superhero movies, what they have to go through with their makeup, and it's so uncomfortable. But that's a part of the job, and you get paid for it, and you just suck it up and and do it because that's part of the performance. And she was complaining about she didn't like the costumes. They didn't make her look good. They weren't comfortable. It's like, you know what? Be happy that you were asked to do it. Right. Suck it up. Very true. Yeah, and, it was Karen Gillan who plays know, Nebula, who has to go through hours of appliances on her face. Yeah, it's insane. Yeah. No, so, so in horrible. short, you're saying Gabby is was a diva and a drama queen. She she was that. a bit of a drama queen, right. a diva, and she should just suck it up and go with the flow. And so. 